Magento is one of the top e-commerce platform in the United States and it's rapidly increasing day by day around the world. Nearly 250k website use Magento and yours could be one of them. Its open source technology gives its users the ability to control the look, functionality and content of their online store. Also, Magento gives its users a variety of tools and features including marketing, SEO and catalog management. If you have an online business and are thinking to use the Magento platforms to expand your business, then you are in the right place. Hello viewers, welcome back to another e-commerce session of Ecom Clips. It's Khalid here from the Ecom Clips team. In today's video, I am going to give an overview of the Magento platform, especially Magento 2. After watching this video, you can decide whether you should consider Magento as an e-commerce platform for your business or not. So keep watching till the end. Magento is an e-commerce website platform owned by Adobe, the global leader in digital media and marketing solutions. Magento offers its customers a wide range of plugins and themes to meet their needs and how they want their website to look. Basically, Magento 2 is the new and improved version of Magento. Magento's developer took the platform down and rebuilt it after receiving concern and comments against Magento. The most important question is why you should consider Magento 2 for your e-commerce business. Ok, I am going to read out a few points that I noted down. If this rings true with you, then you can consider Magento 2 for your e-commerce business. Feature rich and powerful platform, SEO friendly, faster loading speed, flexible content, management, highly optimized, advanced reporting. Offers free service, a supportive community that will help you user navigate issues. Well, let you know what's new on Magento 2. We highlighted a few significant features of Magento 2 that users will appreciate. Flexible architecture for websites. Engaging customer experiences, efficient business experiences, 50% faster loading speed, easier maintenance and upgrades. If you don't update your Magento to Magento 2 yet, we recommend you to update it. Now it's time to discuss Magento 2 cost. Price is always an X factor before starting your business or buying something. So before starting your business on Magento 2, you should have to take into account the cost. Magento 2 comes in two major variants and they have different pricing plans. First one is Magento Open Source, which is also known as Community Edition. And second one is Magento Commerce or Enterprise Edition. Magento Open Source is completely free, but building the store and making it live would include costs like domain, hosting, design and development, which could cost approximate a minimum of $6,000 per month. Can you imagine the cost of Magento Commerce or Enterprise Edition? How much? Is it $6,000, $7,000 or $10,000? No way, it's out of the box because Magento Commerce starts from approximately $22,000. Although some expenses such as hostings and other services are covered in the Magento Commerce subscription, it still requires other operating fees bringing the total cost to between $30,000 to $50,000. Too high, right? Okay, let's move forward to another important section, Magento 2 Customer Support. As Magento is no longer supported on the platform, so you cannot get any update from the developers. This means you are left to figure out the platform on your own. But with Magento 2, open source does not come with customer support. This means customer support is available for the Magento Commerce version only. Now it's time to talk about the Magento 2 payment gateways. Basically, Magento comes with two payment gateways option by default, credit cards and PayPal. But other payment gateways such as Braintee, Stripe, Authorize.net, Amazon Pay, 2 Checkout, and others are also available. We are nearly close to complete the Magento 2 overview. Just one more important section is left to discuss and that is drawbacks of Magento 2. Every bin has it black. As a result, even after updating the previous version, the Magento 2 platform has several drawbacks. Let's take a look at some of Magento 2's limitations that can make you reconsider using it as your e-commerce platform. Complexity. System has a very large and complex structure. So to build an online store on Magento 2, you will need really strong and professional teams of developers and testers. Cost of development. Usually, Magento site development requires a large investment of time and knowledge, which justifies its high cost. Time. Customization of Magento store takes longer than customization of other e-commerce platforms. Cost. Magento Community Edition is free, but for the Enterprise Edition, the cost is really too high. So, this is all about Magento and Magento 2. We tried to recap all the key factors to give you an overall idea about Magento and Magento 2. We expect you can make a decision by watching this video whether you will use Magento for your e-commerce business or not. 
Still, if you have any confusion regarding the Magento, please drop your comment in the comment box. We will get back to you with proper solutions. Besides, if you are an e-commerce business owner and looking for an e-commerce solution provider, then feel free to contact us. You can also visit our website www.ecomclips.com to know more about ecomclips. We are grateful to you for watching this video till the end. Please subscribe to our channel for more e-commerce related videos and don't forget to like and share this video. Have a good day.